Okay, good morning, Saturday 15th of September. Start the day with a nice breakfast here before we go and see Old Delhi. And the thing that we like here is just now so nice and green out of the windows. Okay, so we just spent the morning uh, talking to the lady that owns the, or lives in the house here. So she's been extremely helpful and uh, giving us advice on places where we can go and visit here in Delhi. It just is just so much to take in. Also the history of India and uh, all the different rulers that have ruled India and the customs and religions. There's so much information. But that was just a great start to uh, get some introduction to India. But, uh, hopefully we can pass some of that on as we go around uh, the places the next few days. But uh, she's extremely helpful, extremely kind person. You know, spending time with us just to teach us, give us a quick <laughs> course in everything about India in uh, such a short time. So we're really grateful for that. But uh, Our map of India now is completely covered in circles and uh, notes and uh, all different things, information of places where we're going to go. But uh, what we're actually going to do is dive straight in because now we're here. Uh, we're actually living in the southern part of uh, Delhi, nice area. Um, it's the village we went to yesterday, house, cows, village here, at dinner, but uh, not far from here. But now what we're doing, jumping on the metro. This is the metro here, which is a, an easy way, a fast way to get around Delhi. I'm actually going and diving straight in by going to Old Delhi. And this is the Red Fort here. And there's a, the biggest mosque in Asia is next to that. And uh, some of uh, the old market. Um, and bizarre we can show you. It's going to be a little bit intense and noisy, but uh, we we'll give it a go. Okay, let's go and get on the metro. Okay, now we are probably going to have the biggest experience of our whole trip today. Are you ready? No. Yeah. Where are we going? Old Delhi. Old Delhi, and even Indian people say it's, it's very busy. busy. So, so we've been worried, but also been exciting. Okay, let's give it a go. Yes. Here we go. Let's go to Old Delhi. Goodbye. Okay, so this is the metro we're taking here. Green Park Metro Station. Okay, now we have three tokens to Old Delhi. This is the tickets. <laughs> Okay, so welcome to Old Delhi. What a world. So, let's go and have a look around. Okay, we heard that Old Delhi was chaotic. Now we know exactly what they mean. There are footpaths, which is impossible to use. People just walk anywhere. What a street. Never seen a street like this in my life. Okay, we didn't actually realize that places like this actually existed in real life. We thought they were just in films. And this is amazingly real. It doesn't actually feels a bit strange to be in a place like this. Completely chaotic, but extremely amazing and interesting. There's just things to look at everywhere. Just amazing how many things are going on at one time. I think we'd imagine if I watched the video afterwards, it would look like this is just a background, something going on, and then they just put us two in like a or three in as a film clip. That's what it feels like. Okay, this behind me is the Red Fort. One of the main attractions here in uh, Old Delhi, but we just uh, fought our way through. 
nationally built by uh, Shah Yah and that built this red fort. And uh, also the same person that built the Taj Mahal. And he had a very uh, beautiful daughter that uh, she used to be kept inside here. And uh, she was bored, so he actually built the um, marketplace that's opposite the red fort here. We'll go and have a look at that maybe tomorrow. Um, his, daughter, his daughter, she used to be covered so she could walk around the marketplace and enjoy the, the town. And so we haven't got much time today, we don't have time to go in, so just a quick look at the outside and then we'll come back tomorrow I think and have a proper look around this place. Uh, extremely interesting place. And uh, Delhi's actually been built uh, seven times, rebuilt, and uh, the city centre's been moved seven times. But this actually, uh, old Delhi, this is the sixth time it was rebuilt, believe it or not. So, uh, and the seventh time was the British time. But uh, this is old Delhi. So we'll be going to all the other places, even the first city of uh, Delhi will be going to in the next few days. So. Okay, behind us here, this is the Shane Temple. Uh, Shane, that's actually a, a religion. Um, it's an offspring of Hinduism. Actually a religion of very, very peaceful people. They don't believe in harming anything at all, not even a fly. That's why uh, they actually wear a covering in front of their mouth so they don't breathe in any flies. Um, very peaceful people. I just uh, speaking to a lady in there, so uh, very peaceful and a uh, nice lady. So they're also vegetarians, so uh, she told us we should uh, become vegetarians if you want to be healthy. So <laughs> we'll uh, have to see if we can do that. But, uh, Interesting place, then we have to learn more about this religion. Seems very interesting. Something we didn't know anything about really this morning until we heard about it in the hotel. So, uh, so I think we should learn some more. Yes, and yeah? Uh, yeah, and actually some of them take their clothes off, but mm. we didn't see anybody, so oh. I don't think... Okay. Now we're about to walk down a very famous road here in Old Delhi. Shadney Chowk Road. I'm not sure how to pronounce it, but something like that. And that is this way. Let's go and have a look at this. One. Okay, we just found another metro station with a kind of triangle through the old Delhi here. So we're going to go to New Delhi. We've been uh, told about a restaurant, Indian restaurant that's really good. So let's see if we can get, uh, get there and uh, have a look at that. Okay, so that was a tour through, or well, quick tour through old Delhi. Probably the biggest experience of this whole trip. New old so Old Delhi is actually the most densely populated part of the whole world. So what we've just walked through, you won't find anywhere in the world more densely populated than that. Every square meter there's something going on, something to look at, somebody's selling something, somebody's lying in the street, somebody's trying to drive a rickshaw in front of you. Absolutely everywhere is packed with yeah. stuff. Unbelievable, what a place. And uh, lots of electricity cables everywhere, just everywhere. Yeah. There are not a single uh, like um, how to say every 10 meters there are cables you can see up in the uh, in the poles yeah, so. and little shops everywhere and with old signposts that's probably 50 years old or something like that at least and without Older, any that, without any organization or nice square facades of the shop is just messy yeah, but actually the, uh, the sales people that work here they're the richest people in India because the turnover is just so great in this area. So even though the stalls look old and primitive, they're actually extremely wealthy, the people that work here. So, uh, yeah, that was a good visit. We'll be back here tomorrow and we'll see the temples tomorrow and the, the red forts. But that was a quick <laughs> introduction to uh, Old Delhi. Yeah, and 
now we're going back to New Delhi, not Old Delhi. Finish with Old Delhi. Or maybe tomorrow we will come back to Old Delhi with the metro. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Because our hotel lady told us not to eat in Old Delhi. So yeah. we'll go to New Delhi. Uh, yeah, even though the food here is supposed to be amazing, but uh, she advised us not to eat here. So. That's what we're doing. Okay, let's go. Okay, the curry now. This is just the security. That's women over there, and men over here. Just have a security check before we go on the metro. Okay, so we just come out here. The Metro Khan Market. This is uh, New Delhi. Much quieter. <laughs> Right away, we'll be coming here one of the days as well for a better look around. Now we're going to find a restaurant we've been recommending and, uh, and get something to eat. Yeah, this is New Delhi, completely different atmosphere, very quiet, organized, neat and tidy. We've been recommended this restaurant here, have more, it's an Indian restaurant. Let's hope uh, there's space for us here. Indian food. So, this is one of the main reasons why we came to India. This is to taste food. Um, this is called Mughlai food. It's not just a kind of Indian food that's now spreading through India. So we've been recommended to come here. Yeah. Extremely nice place compared to <laughs> the uh, noise of old Delhi. Now it's nice and quiet here. Okay, so at quarter to twelve now. That was the end of an amazing first day here in Delhi. I started the day talking to the owner for most of the morning but she was extremely helpful giving us some tips and advice and teaching us and telling us about the history of Delhi and through the seven generations that the city has been rebuilt so that was uh, extremely useful for us and giving us some great tips that we'll hopefully can pass on in the next few days if we can remember everything we've been told and uh, giving us some good places to go and have dinner like we did this evening so that was great and we spent the Next few hours of the afternoon trying to sort out SIM cards for our telephones, which wasn't that easy here. Nowhere near as near as easy as it was in the Kyrgyzstan. You had to run back and forward from the hotel getting photocopies of all kinds of things. But yeah, now we have that, so uh, that should be working. And then uh, we went here yeah, on the metro to Old Delhi. What a great experience that was. That's probably the uh, busiest, noisiest place we've ever been on this trip but uh, extremely interesting place but uh, we had a quick look um, down two of the main streets there and a quick look at the red fort but uh, tomorrow we'll go back there and spend most of the day there I think and uh, see the red fort inside and uh, the, the, there's uh, two or three mosques there we can see as well um, plus uh, maybe have a look at the bizarre we'll see how much we can do there's an uh, extremely lot of things to do here in Delhi amazing then we finished the evening, yes, in a restaurant in New Delhi, which is a completely different atmosphere. I didn't film anything because it's, uh, it was dark by the time we got there, but uh, I'll try and we'll go there one of the days this next few days and film there as well. That's a completely different place. So, uh, yeah, so interesting first day. It's going to take three or four days just to digest what we've seen today. Amazing. You see life in all its uh, colours from... Uh, both good and bad. We've seen uh, some pretty sad things as well today, which I haven't filmed. But, uh, yeah, life is here in all its uh, glory and uh, its sadness in Delhi here. <laughs> it's uh, yeah, extremely interesting place, absolutely amazing place. So okay, that's it for today. We'll uh, take a better look at uh, Delhi tomorrow and uh, in old Delhi one more time. Okay, good night. See you tomorrow.